moment years in the making and decades of waiting finally arrived this afternoon. One veteran from Steuben County was awarded the Bronze Star for his service overseas nearly 50 years ago. That's right. I traveled to the American Legion in Canastillo earlier this afternoon for the incredibly emotional dedication ceremony. Douglas Davis is filled with pride after being officially pinned with the Bronze Star Medal. But pride wasn't always a feeling he believed he earned. It was really a hard thing to talk about when you were uh, back from Vietnam because nobody wanted to hear you. On Friday, a full American hero treatment is allowing the two-time Purple Heart veteran to feel respected. We did our jobs the way we were called on to do, and that's now I think people getting that recognition and, you know, and, and me, it feels so good to know that, you know, so I don't have to feel bad that I, I served my country the way when they called on me. Friends and family joined in the celebration. Douglas's wife of nearly 50 years recalls life during wartime and their special bond. It was lonely and I wrote him every day. I don't think I ever missed a day. The only thing is he always tried to write me back and at the point where he had was injured, all of a sudden there was no mail. And that was a little frightening because I didn't know what was going on and I had to find out. While the pitting ceremony is a moment in time, the Bronze Star Medal will represent these memories forever. It was so exciting for him and he's been so nervous and so I'm so nervous. It's just wonderful. I hoped that he would get this someday because I knew he wanted to give it to his son. And now he'll be able to. I love him. I just love him so much. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's great that, that they've come out and recognized his service and everything. And, and I'm hoping that this will uh, help, 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 him, help, him, help him out a little bit, yeah. you know, uh, maybe get a little closure. Week for Douglas. He celebrated his 68th birthday this past Wednesday. Very happy birthday. Shout out to him. And WEMY News would like to thank Douglas Davis for his service and sacrifice for our country.